Hey guys, Parminder here with your hourly coverage of Dance Marathon 2013. We are 30 hours in. We have two more hours to go. Even though everyone is tired, there's so much energy in this room, it's hard not to stay energized. I am actually here with one of the nicest people you'll ever meet. This is Sam. Hi, Sam. How are you? Hi. <laughs> and you, as you can see, Sam is on a crutch. She hurt her foot. Can we get a shot of her foot really quick? <laughs> Sam, how did you hurt your foot? Please explain. Well, on Easter Sunday, I was going down my basement stairs and I actually fell and fractured my ankle. <laughs> And you're still here supporting the children. How does that feel? It's amazing. I love DM. I did it last year. I did this year. I can't imagine a year without DM anymore. It's part of my life. That's crazy. And how, have you gotten a chance to sit down at all? Um, I got to sit down for a little bit because I had to take a break. But I've I've been here for about 30 hours so far. And you have two more hours to go. How does that make you feel? Excited. <laughs> I'm very ready to go home. What are you planning on doing when you go home? Sleeping. I bet, I bet. And you bought some things from the auction. I did. What did you buy? Well, I bought two artworks done by the Miracle Children, and I'm actually going to put them on my sorority room um, house, and they're going to stay in my house forever to remind our sisters. And I actually bought a pillow signed by all of the Mir Miracle Children. That's great. That's awesome. And I think it's so wonderful that you're here even on a crutch. So thank you so much. Thank Enjoy you. your evening, and I'll see you soon. Thanks. everyone, Parminder Bunga here with your hourly coverage of Dance Marathon 2013. As I mentioned earlier, we are 30 hours in. There's two more hours to go. Everyone is holding strong. Right now, I am here with Michelle and Zoe. Hi, guys. Hi. Hi. <laughs> so, Michelle, why are you here today? Um, I have been a part of Dance Marathon since I was a freshman here at Bowling Green. Currently, I'm an alumni. It's just um, a wonderful, wonderful cause. Seeing these kids happy. Um, after what they've been through is just amazing to me. And Michelle, you said you were a part of, you worked for Dance Marathon last year? I was or a while ago? Yeah, um, I'm just a first year alumni right now, but I was part of the steering committee last year. I was family relations. So I got really close to these guys and um, know a lot of the families and got to connect a little bit better than just your average um, BG dancer or anything like that. So, and Can you tell us something about Zoe? Yeah, Zoe is um, a sec third year miracle child actually, and she has an immune deficiency, so she gets um, sick easily. She can't really do a lot of things um, with other kids, like go in public swimming pools or anything like that, because she can catch um, a sickness like way faster than any other kid. Um, so she goes to the hospital like every three weeks um, for treatment, but you know, she's just an average little girl who's silly and loves to dance. Why is this so important for you? I know it's for the children, but why exactly is this so important to you? Honestly, I just love seeing them happy. Like, after going on hospital visits and just seeing, you know, some of these kids be in the hospital and what, like, how strong they are, like, actually just motivates me just to do something to give back to them. That's wonderful. Thank you so much. Thank you so much, Zoe. Say hi. In the, say hi to the camera. Say hi. Hi. Can I get a high five? Thank yeah. you so much. Thank you guys so much. We'll have more for you coming up very soon. Please stay tuned. Keep checking our YouTube page, Facebook page, Twitter page. Just keep checking back. We'll see you very soon. See you later.